The new year brought plenty of new snow to the Highway 24 corridor, especially from Manitou Springs to Lake George. Yeah, Caradio News Channel 13, Scott Harrison is live in Woodland Park on this first day of 2015, continuing our team coverage. And Scott, much wider New Year's Day than Christmas this season. Yeah, JJ, that's for sure. And with the towns, Christmas lights still up and still on. The snow really makes for a pretty scene out here. Now, earlier today, the scene wasn't quite so lovely for at least one driver trying to make his way around as that snow began accumulating around noon today. And we have video, <coughs> excuse me, we have video to show you exactly what we mean. There were two guys from Pueblo who got stuck in the right westbound lane of Highway 24 in Ute Pass. Traffic had to go around them for a little while. Fortunately, some good Samaritans from right here in Woodland Park pushed the car to safety. We spoke with the passenger of that car. Heading up to Cooper Creek, just lost traction. Rear rear drive, can't make it. <laughs> now we're stuck. Can you call somebody to help you? Are you going to be okay? Yeah, we're going to call a tow truck. Uh huh. Get him out here. Did you didn't expect this to happen today, did you? No, we're in my vacation. But the snow was also heavy to the west at Lake George in Park County. Fortunately, though, that didn't snow, slow the traffic down very much. Plows kept busy up and down Highway 24, trying to clear away that snow, snow as quickly as possible. But the day wasn't all work, at least for one family here in Woodland Park. They said, forget the sled, let's get the toboggan out. And so they did. Down the hill they went. Sure looks like a lot of fun there. Another thing to remember tonight if we're going to be driving around, especially through Teller County, is that the roads, streets, and highways are snowpacked. So please drive carefully. We're live in Woodland Park tonight. Scott Harrison, KRDO News Channel 13.